Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Pierre and this is Simple Homebrew. I'm doing a beer right now, but that's not what I'm here for. I'm doing an unboxing of a Kegland wine bottling kit. This is a, a really cool kit and I thought I'd just share it with you before I start actually bottling my wine that I will share in a future video. I got this with my wine kit when I bought it from Kegland. Uh, Kegland doesn't sponsor this video, uh, it's just something I'm doing. I wanted to try their wine kits and this is the way I could do it. And uh, I thought I'd share the unboxing of these wine bottles because it's different. I have never bought wine bottles with as much in them. Uh, the kits, I mean. So they offer you, basically, for, for the price, I'll put the price up here, I've forgotten how much they were. Um, you get 12 bottles, uh, sorry, yeah, 12 bottles. Uh, you get a whole bunch of heat shrink caps so that it seals the corks in. So the corks you get are basically 12 as well. And the bottles. So what's so good about this kit is, I mean, making wine is fun and the wine lasts for a long time, so you can sit it. I've got wine here that's three years old, I haven't touched, um, and it gets better as time progresses. But I don't know what's in the bottles anymore. They've been there for so long, I've made about five different wines, and I don't know which one's which. So when I taste it, I go, ah, oh, that's a Merlot, or that's the uh, Cap Sav, or Sauvignon Blanc, or whatever it is. So what I did, what I'm really happy about is these guys supply tickets these guys this is what I like about it it's one of the best things that anybody could do is actually give me a sticker that I can put on the bottle so I know what's in it and it's the first time I've ever come across this as you can see there's um what 10 in each or 12 in each one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so there's ten on each ticket you get two of them look at this you get two of them now there's only what 12 bottles but you still get two stickers so if you make a mistake you can rewrite it and stick it on which is really great um i'm intending to put my beer in this uh sorry i'm intending to put my wine in this and hopefully show you guys what's going on what happened to you that was weird play it up a little bit then um so these bottles are going to be cleaned sanitized they're probably clean anyway from the factory can they be sanitized cleaned and then what i'll have to do then is Soak these corks in sanitizer overnight, just to get, make sure that they're being sanitized properly and also moistened. So when you push them into the bottles, they need to be moistened. And that, that brings me to another point. I went to my local brew shop, which is Greenleaf Hydroponics and Homebrew, and they sold me a bottling press. So this thing here, I haven't used before, it's just the first time. Uh, I have to size it up, make sure it all works, and it pretty much presses everything into the bottle. So if you guys are interested in seeing that video, it's coming up. I've got a wine video happening, um, which will be around oh, three weeks time from here, from this video, maybe two. And uh, it'll show me using this. It's gonna be a long video. I've already processed half of it or um, edited half of it. Uh, it's gonna be a long one, if you're interested. And it will show me using this product. And uh, obviously, corking all these bottles and going for it like that. So yeah, so I thought I'd quickly unbox this, give you a bit of an insight on what it is and how it works, and uh, what I'm going to do in the near future, what, what videos are coming up. Cheers guys, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, thank you to my Patreons, if you want to support this channel, please do. Uh, I use your money to buy these products to actually showcase them and show you guys. I don't have anybody sponsoring me outside of Patreon, so this is the only way I get products. Cheers guys, see you soon.